When you think of creating art, you might think of paintbrushes, clay, but how about a chainsaw, folks? And this week's For Your Community News Force, Joe Dubin, shows us works of art created in a most unique way. I always liked art, but I couldn't draw. Off a back road in South Nashville, the sound of a chainsaw echoes through the hills. And it is the sound of an amazing artist at work. Meet Dan Hartley. His grandkids call him Pa. Everybody's porch needs a bear. Welcome to Pa's Chainsaw Creations. Yes, he creates amazing pieces of work by using a chainsaw. And in addition of seeing it to believe it, you have to hear it as well. So you are a mad scientist and this is your laboratory? Something like that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the mad part's pretty good. <laughs> Dan, or Pa, sells his works all over the country. And even the ones he feels like don't make the cut. There's a lot of them that I thought, there ain't no way this will ever sell. I stuck them in the back and you know, somebody that's always the piece they want. But that's not always been the case. When it first started out, all my family members got, got them for Christmas and everything and then <laughs> didn't want them because they weren't that good. Now everybody's <laughs> requesting them. <laughs> yes, yes they are. In Nashville for your community, <laughs> Joe Dubin. <laughs> News 4. <laughs> oh, I love that. Yes. It's so great. If you know of something made in Tennessee that deserves to be spotlighted in a For Your Community story, please let us know. Submit your nomination on WSMV.com. Love to celebrate that mm -hmm. hometown stuff.